I look like a little wee teacup, fuck's sake. Even though it's a winter day, I'm absolutely boiling. Just because I'm running about with these dogs and they just can't, you know, they just want to run about and have fun. But they will always be cold. Right, Rorama, look at that. Look at that mountain. What's that made of? What do you think that's made of? I'm going to tell you what it's made of, right? Because we've been here before. If you followed me back during the summer, you'll know what that's made of. And every time you drive through Glencoe, you will know what that's made of. I feel like my dog's just spotted something. No, come here. Come, come. Come, come. That's made of rhyolitic tufts and lavas. Now, rhyolite is a silica-rich lava. It usually has a temperature, cooling temperature of around 700 degrees Celsius. So it's a lot different to basaltic. And it comes from a granitic magma chamber. There's also andesite in these mountains too, which is another type of lava, another kind of intermediate silica rich lava, right? Pretty cool because usually across Scotland you find like lots of basaltic lava, but in certain areas you find rhyolitic lavas and rhyolitic tuffs and granite and silica rich magmas. And that just represents a period in time we had partial melting of the crust in a mountain belt. That's what that represents, right? Is that not cool? I think it's cool.